Oh, this is going to be excellent if I did this right. All right, here we go. Oh, <laughs> oh we just skimmed. We missed. Uh-oh. Oh, we just broke the game. The, B, uh, the B-25 just disappeared. Hello, YouTube. Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Beamin G Drive. And yes, folks, that's a plane. And you know what we're going to do with the plane here today? We're going to fly it into the bridge. I got so many comments on the last episode about flying some sort of aircraft into this bridge. It was not even funny. Like, I was like, man, feels like the same person's commenting on my videos. But I went through them. Uh, it's from the last episode. You guys were amazing. Uh, you wanted to see more of this. And you specifically wanted to see the plane go into the bridge. Now, I've got several plans. We're not just going to fly the plane into the pillar and call it a day. Uh, we're going to set some cars up on it. Uh, maybe some explosives. We're also going to probably do some more vehicle scenarios uh, with the top of the bridge, too. Because uh, there's a couple things that I missed that I wanted to do from the last episode. So, we're going to be doing that here today. If you are enjoying Beam and G Drive on the channel and want to see more of it, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. Comment below with other things you want to see here in Beam and G Drive. And let's jump right into this. All right, so the first thing we're going to do, we're going to do a baseline test. We are just going to run the plane into the bridge, see what that does. Now, the whole spawning situation with this plane is a little awkward. So I'm going to do basically, uh, sometimes I have to do some brick rigs. I'll spawn the vehicle in air, gain control of it, and then we'll run it into the bridge. Uh, because honestly, with this big one here, which by the way, is this a, I think it's a B-25 or it's a B, no, I think it's a B-25. Uh, we're not going to be able to uh, take this thing off and get off cleanly. So, uh, I say about right in this area up here. Okay, so we're going to spawn it. We're going to punch the throttle. Hopefully the camera corrects itself. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That is not the way I wanted to be, camera. Okay, hold on. Lift. 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 Oh! <laughs> yep, that worked. That worked great, folks. Yeah, as you can see, uh... I'm not the best at flying things, but we're going to make this, uh, this is going to happen. All right, here we go. We are aiming for the pillar. This thing's a little harder to fly than I thought it would be. Uh, we're going to slow down right here. So this is our control test. I'm kind of curious, how much is the pillar going to actually bend? Uh, here we go. Right into the pillar. Are we just going to take it out here? Oh! What the heck? We just sheared it. Like, that wasn't what I expected at all. I really thought it was going to bend more. Uh, is it enough? Yeah, it's going to collapse that bridge completely. Alright, so we know this works. So we have two different approaches we can do. We can take the pillar out and collapse cars on the bridge, or we can aim for the cars and do it that way. And, you know, this is actually really neat. I've not played with this ever before. So this is, like, something completely new. And I must say, doesn't handle the greatest... But the destruction is on point. All right, let's go ahead and drop that. There goes the bridge. Sweet. Okay. So we know it works. We know it's definitely got enough power to blow the bridge up. I guess the question is, let's stick some cars on it. And let's maybe try hitting the cars and see if we can knock them off the bridge while taking the bridge out. Because I feel like just shearing the pillar out from under it uh, isn't always the best scenario. All right, so we've got a little bit of a police blockade here. Don't ask me what they're blocking because obviously you're not going to block a plane, but this is going to work. So my objective, I would actually like to hit a little higher this time. I would like to hit the car. And my thought is I'll blow the mid part of the bridge out and it should fling the other cars off. I don't know, this uh, plane might be wide enough. I think the wings, if I'm high enough, I might actually catch the other police cars. But this is going to look epic. So I'm going to go set up the plane. And we're going to fly right into this bridge and see what happens. Alright, we're coming in for another run here. Let's go ahead and slow down things. Uh, we're looking... Ooh, we're looking pretty good right now, actually. I think we're on target. We might still be taking the pillar out. This thing's a little hard to climb. Uh, angle it up. Angle it up. Okay, here we go. Uh, oh, that is a terrible noise it's making. All right, here we go. Oh, oh, that worked. Actually, that worked pretty good. I didn't quite hit the mid vehicle. 
Oh, and we just collapsed the bridge. Oh, there go all the vehicles. Say goodbye to the cop cars. Man, that is so awesome. All right, let's, uh, let's get down here for some full speed action. And up. Oh. oh, that noise. What is that noise? Up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh. Yes. All right. So I think I've broken something. Uh, some engine or something is, uh, yeah, it sounds like it's going full speed up here. Uh, where'd the, uh, oh, there's the plane. All right, well, that worked out pretty good, too. Uh, you know, we're going to do one more with that big plane. We're actually just going to dive bomb down into the bridge. So I'm going to spawn above it, full throttle, and then we'll just punch right into the bridge. And we'll punch right into a vehicle, too. I think that'll work pretty good. Okay, so I have placed a school bus and a couple cars up on top of the bridge. I need to move the bus a little towards the middle. And what we're going to do, we're going to drop this plane from high above and just plow straight into it full throttle. This should be pretty epic. So, anyways, uh, we're going to spawn right up in that area and see exactly what happens. You know, I've never come down, like, directly on top of that pillar, so I'm going to be uh, interested to see if it actually folds down or if it just kind of pops the pillar pieces out to the side. All right, we are high above. This might freeze my computer a little bit. I'm not really sure. We'll have to probably do this in slow-mo, so... Let's uh, kick that plane. Let's let it drop its nose. Actually, I should probably use the interior here. Oh, oh, oh yeah, this is gonna work. Oh, I think this is gonna work. Oh, we are going really fast. Hold on. Okay, let's pull up here. Use the slow-mo to my advantage. Uh, do I think that is the right? Okay, we're not coming directly down on it. Keep pulling, keep pulling, keep pulling. Aim for the bus a bit. Oh, this is going to be excellent if I did this right. All right, here we go. Oh, <laughs> oh we just skimmed. We missed. Uh-oh. Oh, we just broke the game. The, B, uh, the B-25 just disappeared. What just happened? Uh, yep, we broke it. Look at that. The bus is suspended in air. It has not even fallen yet. Oh, I forgot the Stig's in here. Stig's about to have a bad time. Let's see. Can I resume this without the game crashing? Here we go. Oh, oh okay. So it just removed the B-25. We're going to have to do that again, folks. Uh, I still want to see this fall. Actually, let's ride aboard. I know some people wanted to see that. So, uh, oh, I don't know where this thing is. Um, I don't want to be on this, though. All right. We're going to experience a, a falling from a bridge in a bus. Wait, it hasn't fallen yet. Oh, it's still collapsing. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, the stick just hit the window. Oh, boy. Oh, oh. Oh, that was cool. All right, so I think we're down at the bottom of the river here. Oh, there's still a bridge coming down. That was insane. Okay, let's try that again. Let's hopefully, uh, hopefully the B-25 doesn't do what it just did there. All right, here we go. Once again, kind of get my bearings here. Looking good. That's the bridge down there. Slow it down, that way I can make sure... Okay, yeah, we're good. We're golden. We're golden. I think we're good. Alright, we might be off track a little bit. On uh, to the left. To the left. Oh, no. No! No, yeah, I'm, we're, we're gonna hit it. We're gonna hit the bridge, definitely. Here we go. What is wrong with the vehicles? Oh! <laughs> oh, there is something just wrong... Oh, yeah, that, uh... I think the B-25 is a little too janky to do this. We might have to go smaller, because every time we seem to collide or do something with it, it either freezes the game like this. Uh, let's go and resume it real quick. Yeah, that B-25 does not like being smashed into a bridge. Oh, wait, is the bus going to balance there? Oh, let's go full speed. Oh, the bus is doing it! Wait, what? Uh, oh, never mind. Oh, oh, it just collapsed. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, there goes the bus. Oh, the bus is actually meshed in with some of the bridge right now. It's insane. Oh, stuff is, yeah, stuff's erupting. All right, we're going to move on to a different plane here. We're going to go a little smaller, but I do believe we're going to go a little faster. Almost like a missile. So, yeah, that is not, not good at all. Let's go ahead and restart the map here. 
All right, so meet the bridge's next opponent. This is an old uh, German craft. I believe this was one of their first jets, if not their first jet. Uh, this thing is awesome, and this is going to be like a missile. Uh, the B-25 had a lot of area to it, but, I mean, come on. The speeds that we're going to hit, this is going to be ridiculous. Plus, this is a, a lot more controllable than the other craft, so I think I could be a little bit more precise in my shots. Uh, speaking of, does this thing have a cockpit in it? Uh, oh yeah, that is cool. All right, let's go ahead and swing back around. We're going to do a control test with the bridge first, and then we'll start setting some vehicles up there and try to take them out. Looking for the bridge. Uh, I think it's right through. Oh, no, 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 no. Camera, camera. Okay, camera. Oh, slow it down. Slow it down. Okay, there's the bridge. Uh, oh, this is a lot tighter canyon on this side. Oh, this might be a bit of a challenge. I would go to their person here, but the camera's backwards at the moment. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, we're going to... Uh-oh. Oh. oh. Uh, <laughs> well, there's your control test. Are we still going to fling stuff into the bridge? Oh, we barely skimmed it. Yeah, that canyon's a lot tighter on that side. All right, we'll definitely have to come in from this side. Uh, let's do that one more time. All right, we're back. We're ready to do another control test here. One where we don't crash into the canyon. Uh, yeah, full throttle. Oh, we are going so fast. All right, here we go. Uh! Wow, that thing hits so hard. It just shears off whatever it wants. Like, that's not even really a... That's more of a missile than a jet there. This is going to work excellent. We clean that bridge completely off. All right, so... Let's get to spawning and let's get a couple vehicles up here. This is gonna be cool. Okay, so we have another police blockade here. We have five cop cars, plus we have the jet spawned in right now. I'm pretty sure my game's gonna do a little bit of freezing here, but uh, we're gonna hit this normal. I was thinking about going straight down, but I'm gonna save that uh, for a bigger vehicle. So we're gonna come in, try to take out the center of the bridge and fling these cop cars. So let's go ahead. We're gonna go over to the jet and we're gonna get in the air. All right, fun fact, I just realized this thing has cannon rounds in it. Okay. How I missed that, I don't know. All right, prepare for the freeze. This is probably not going to be pretty here. We're going to go ahead and start to slow down time. Uh, that way we can prevent this from completely freezing up. Oh, yeah. You know what? Maybe I should shoot some cannon rounds at these. Oh, those might be more effective than I think they are. Are we going to hit the bridge already? Hold on. Oh, that is too cool. Oh, we just hit the bridge. Uh-oh. Uh, that's not how I wanted to end this, hold Let's go ahead and dive down. Dive down. We still got to crash into it here. Oh, this is so cool looking. Oh, <laughs> oh there we go. We flung the cop cars. Oh, boy. All right, that cannon is actually really good. Uh, I did not expect that to do that, but we're still getting the same result here. All right, so we definitely erupted a fuel cell on one of the cop cars. Uh, let's go ahead and go... Uh, full speed. I don't know if I want to be in any of these cop cars. Oh, there they go. Oh, to the bottom of the river. Hey. Hey, look at that. Oh, that's kind of neat. One of the cop cars actually made it. You know, this guy's probably in decent shape. Uh, the car doesn't look to be... I mean, it's damaged, but it doesn't look like it's uh, fatal. Uh, now as far as ever... Oh, did this one cop car... Oh, it got crushed. Oh, it got crushed between the canyon pieces... The bridge coming down on it, that's insane. All right, it appears the other cop cars made it down to the bottom of the uh, the river here. Uh, where did the jet go? Oh, here it is. I believe it's uh, what's on fire out here. Yeah, where's the cockpit at? Um, Maybe potential. Oh, there it is. Yeah, it's only partially on fire. I could have totally made it out of that. All right, so now we know that the, the plane has cannons on it. I kind of want to come straight down on a bridge on a large vehicle. And take it out that way. Alright, so the family has decided to go ahead and camp up on the bridge. We have these huge campers. Now, question is, can I fit two of these up here without the bridge collapsing? Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and go up here. la di da Oh, I have a feeling this is going to collapse the bridge. Kind of hoping not, because these will be really good vehicles to run into with the plane. So, here we go. Oh. Oh. Looking good. Looking good. Oh, okay. Looking good. All right, I want to get them a little closer together. So we're going to park this one here. Let's go back to the other one and back you up just a bit. Hey, the bridge actually held up. Oh, it's 
All right, it's somewhat holding up. Now, I do see the stress, and I see where the uh, the pieces are starting to separate, but we're good. All right, I'm going to go get the jet, and we're going to fly directly down into this. Now, I'm not going to use the cannons for this approach, because I want to see this jet be a missile and just run right down the camper here. All right, we are going down towards the bridge once again. I think I'm at a little... Oh, I'm starting to wobble here. Uh, we are going fast. Okay, let's try to hit it about like that. I'm going to pull up a bit, point the nose down a bit. I really want to hit the RV. Uh, a little over to the side, a little over to the side. Here we go. I believe that is going to be probably a hit. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh that was the coolest thing ever. We almost split that RV in half. Look how bent it is. All right. Oh, here comes the other one. Actually, does this thing have an interior? Oh, yay. Wait, can we sit in that? That would be really cool if we could sit in that. Oh, it actually caught the base of the bridge there. Uh, what's it going to do? Okay, what's the odds here of anybody surviving this? Let's go ahead and get down here. Speed her up. Oh, 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 oh. Hey. Oh, this might work. Uh, uh oh, <laughs> no, no, uh, that wasn't so bad. Hey, that actually held up pretty good. Let's go inside. Yeah, not too, uh, not too shabby. All right, where's the rest of the, where's the other RV at? We absolutely annihilated that RV. That was a tremendously hard hit. And the good thing was, is the whole fact that you have the bridge below it, so it gives. So it allowed that plane to basically mesh all the way down through the RV. If it would have been solid ground, it just would have flattened everything out. That was cool. Kind of want to do that again. Uh, but what I think I'm going to do, we're going to do one more plane event here, but I'm going to shoot as I'm going down just to see what happens. All right, here we come down on the bridge. I'm in slow-mo here. That way we can see the shots. Let's go ahead. We're going to start pepper in here. Oh, you can release a ton of those. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, we're hitting the bridge. Oh, we're hitting it. Oh, <laughs> oh, we still wound up hitting the RV on the way down. We were collapsing the bridge as we were hitting it. Oh, that was great. So, yeah, we were hitting the bridge with the cannon, and then the plane just comes and just annihilates the RV once again. And, oh. Oh, yeah, that thing is in bad shape. That is cool looking. All right, folks, I got one more plan with the bridge here. So this is either going to end with us crashing or shooting this tanker on the bridge, or it might end with this uh, tanker just crashing through the bridge. I don't know. This thing is full right now, and I don't know what the load capacity on that bridge is. I want to say anywhere between 40,000 pounds, maybe 35 to 40. It's not tremendously high. Uh, one of the bulldozers or one of the dump trucks from the last episode crashed right through this so we're gonna attempt this if I can get this set up we're gonna try to blow this thing up on the bridge I just don't know if this is gonna work so here we go oh boy all right oh oh we're doing it we're doing it beautiful uh oh uh oh oh uh oh okay wow that, uh, that actually did not somewhat work. I don't know what to say. Uh, we're stuck. So, the bridge isn't collapsing, which is good. At least not yet. I think I can get in the plane, and I think we can take this out. I was kind of hoping the bridge wouldn't have any damage, but I don't think that's possible right here. Alright, folks, we are at full speed here. You know, I was thinking about shooting it at first, but I think we're just going to crash into the tanker. I think that's going to be the best option here and create the most chaos. So the tanker is barely holding on to the bridge and we are about to slam a jet into the tanker. So this is gonna be a good day, folks. Uh, pull up a little bit, looking good, looking good. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh -oh. don't miss it, don't miss, don't miss. <gasps> yes, oh, we sheared the back of it off. Oh, there it goes, oh, just exploded. Hold on, where's the jet? Oh, the jet's still going, oh, never mind. Nope, jet's done. Oh, wow. Wait, where'd the... Where's the truck at? No way. No way the truck survived that. The tank just got launched off. The truck survived. How in the heck? 
man, I really wish I had a view from the truck. That was probably the most amazing thing ever. If that would have been in full speed and you would just have seen the jet come by and take your trailer off. Uh, huh. Well, just might be the truck's lucky day. Oh, let's get over to the truck. Uh, question is, can the truck get itself out of this predicament? Oh, no, no. Hold on, shimmy. Come on, let's see if we can save the truck here. I don't think, no, we are, uh, we're high centered here. Oh, well, at least the truck driver survived. Um, I didn't really expect that part of this, but that's still pretty cool. But anyways, folks, that's probably going to about wrap it up for this episode of Beam and G Drive. If you have any suggestions for future Beam and G episodes, comment below. Uh, we'll be returning with some more cop chases and stuff like that probably next episode. Uh, I'm going to try to do these uh, at least two times a week. Uh, I realize how much I miss playing this game, so I'll definitely be seeing more of this on the channel. But yeah, if you like to like and subscribe, everything helps my channel. Thank you guys for all the love and support on the Beam NG series, and we will see you guys next time on Beam NG Drive. Thank you.